Hey folks, this is Bobo the Vulture, and this is Let's Play Steambot Chronicles. And, uh, last time we found some giant beast fossils. Hmm, are you delighted by giant beast fo fossils? <laughs> I guess you are, Dino. Dino is excited about the prospect of these giant beast fossils. Who can blame Dino? I can't blame Dino. Hey there. Um, I could wager, but honestly, probably better off doing battle. Let's see. I'm not, I'm not cool enough to fight Gluttonous Boss Elfin yet. Let's see. Yeah, go ahead and fight the burning firefighter, Rooney. Yeah, go ahead and battle, Rooney. Um, let me set up my shop mobile just because I'm pretty sure I need to repair my arm. Yeah. Now I'm ready for battle. Ready for battle. Oh, baby, I'm ready for battle. Ready for battle. Ooh, baby, I'm... Yeah, let's fight Rooney, the, burn, the burning firefighter. Let's do all that. All that, folks. Oh, and if we're in the home Nephroburg Arena... Shh, yeah, Connie will actually come out and uh, cheer us on. Rooney versus... Yeah! I don't get that, because our name is Vanilla no matter what. Why the person that cheers for us automatically goes, Aah! Enough of that. Wow, I'm actually not doing as well as I could. But I keep thrusting him. That'll do the job in the end. Woo! I mean, yeah! I won, man. I am the winner. A winner is me. Battle results are me winning. That's how it goes. Congratulations to me. I'm the winner. <sighs> I'll go ahead and enter again. Go ahead and sweep these guys. It'll improve my win-loss record. Alright, set up my shop mobile. Each of these guys winning against each of these guys, I'm still trading in uh, victory medals for gold at the rate of 10 to 1, or 1 to 10. 10 victory, or 10 gold, or you are, will get me one victory medal. That's the thing I'm trying to say here. Isabel! I can tell! Wishing well! Fare thee well! Okay, well, and well. But there are two different kinds of wells. Oh, well, you have a cannon arm. That's right. I actually have to be careful. Woo! 
That's the way you do it. You play your guitar on the MTV. I believe I had the nickname Chatty Clock already, didn't I? Maybe I was the Chatty Kid. I hadn't gotten the clock at that point, but I could have sworn I had the nickname Chatty Kid already. I don't know. Congratulations. Vanilla is the winner. And I got some medals. Yeah, let's go ahead and fight Bomber Boy Chucky. Yeah, I'm gonna battle with Chucky. Why do you say that like your suspect? Are you really gonna battle with Chucky? But Chucky's an unstoppable killing machine. He'll never make it. Give me some gladiator info here. Bomberhead. He is the bomber boy. He is the bomber boy. Get him! I'm betting on you! Take some ass! Woo! Chucky! Yeah! I mean, admittedly, Chucky's got a really agile little, uh, Trimobile there, but he has no weapon to speak of. Yeah, man. I won. I won. <laughs> By the way, the secret to success is definitely to go <laughs> at all times. That's what does it for Vanilla. Congratulations, you won. Thank you for your patronage. The next battles will be tonight, eh? No, I'm good. Oh, our trouble bill is downstairs. We should probably go get it. I could just leave this building and then walk back in. I'm pretty sure it will turn nighttime the next time I leave this building. But, uh. <laughs> hey, Chucky. Next time, get it. Isabel? Yep, you're ready at all times. That's cool. I meant to find out what you say when you lose to me. Not like. Yes, you do. It, it, it's you should. Rooney, the burning firefighter, actually seems like a pretty good guy. Maybe a little single-minded, um, but uh, you know he's single-minded about public defense, so that's good. Yeah, they did manage to rebuild the, the buildings. Never mind. I'm going to stockpile all of my honey until it's actually important that you care about how I uh, about my whole lotted life. Ooh. Sorry about that, folks. A little bit of a yawn there. I, uh... Slept in today, but, uh... I was up very late the previous night slash morning. That's the way my schedule goes, I guess. Work a night job, so that'll happen. Yep, pretty much that's what's going on here right now, so... Let's go to the, uh... Seagull Beach exit. We can go looking around for the fishing license at night, right? I mean, maybe it won't be very easy to find, I'm not sure. I think I just have to look. There were a bunch of crates that uh, were floating around in the water. I probably just have to like look in the crates or something. It's been a while, folks. I'm fuzzing out the details of the game. It's not a blind Let's Play, because I know this game, and I love this game, actually, honestly. Like, one of the reasons I wanted to play this as opposed to Metal Gear. Um, I think I might have mentioned a couple videos ago. But, like, this game, like... I can be in a sour mood, or a bad mood, or just ups, you know, like, ticked off at life in general, and, uh, yeah, I just, I, this is a feel-good, this is the feel-good game of the season right here. Anybody that has any, like, that thinks this game looks at all interesting from just watching this, uh, Let's Play, go out and find a copy if you can. It may be a little expensive, because I don't think they made that many copies. Um... It was not as it was not a runaway success. Let's put it that way. So you are the mechanic guy. Where's the bus stop? Is there anybody that actually wants to uh, go for a ride at this hour? I want to take you for a ride. 
Not too far. There appears to be just a mechanic over there. I thought there was a bus stop on this side. Oh, there is. And no one's at it. No one wants to be bussed around. Well, fine. Now, I seem to recall the baddies around here. They're fairly simple. Fairly simple matter of picking these guys up and throwing them at each other. are doing a number on me. All my riches fell into the water. Alright, well, that uh, actually went rather poorly. So let me come back up here and uh, repair myself. Let me fix myself. How much will it cost to repair myself from this level of damage anyway? I have to admit to being a little curious. Phew. Pricey. Alright, well, the enemies are defeated now, so... There is all of that. Actually, one last guy that's still trying to fire missiles at me from uh, down at the bottom of the ocean. There is water at the bottom of the ocean! Enough of you, friend. I'm just going to walk this way. Yeah, okay, here's the right direction. Over to your right, you can see the remains of uh, Boss Elephant. Or not Boss Elephant, uh, what do they call the big. Uh... More of you jerks. Forget it. You guys aren't worth my time. Also, please don't hurt me. <laughs> See what I did there? Yeah, you know, I haven't been over here to the High Hayabusa Carpet Mill since, um... I pretty much saved their bacon, have I? Hey, man. Did you come to buy carpet? I'm sure there's lots of places to be interested in our carpet. I could sell leaves, dye, or water. Or I could stock carpet. Thank you, come again. Yeah, I'm gonna park here. I'm gonna park here, I'm gonna run. Oh, I'm hungry. There's Seagull Beach. Connie. No. Hey, old guy who runs this place. Just not efficient enough. At this rate, it'll take even longer to weave a single carpet. They use machines to do this overseas. I thought my research would be enough, but this just, just isn't working. Was that so? Well, that's interesting. So, he wants to figure out a more efficient way to make, uh... He wants to find a more efficient way to weave carpets. That's good to know. How's that place where they have all the silkworms? Ugh. Hungry vanilla is 
coming at you. Alright, um... I kinda don't feel like running around in the uh, silkworm place right now, actually. But that's good to note. I will... Uh, if I just walk at normal pace, I'm not hungry at all. Do do do. I'm not hungry. Oh wait, I'm hungry. Let's go ahead and climb aboard the old trap mobile. We can head over to Seagull Beach here. Why the heck not, right? Why the heck not, indeed. Big Eget Brook downstream. What the? There's, oh, that's just a guy running around on a horse there. Hey there, guy on a horse. Traveling is hard when you have to rely on horses. What I wouldn't give for a trot mobile. Well, you should have just cut. You should have just been brought to consciousness for, as far as you know, the first time in your life. Right in front of a trotmobile that you could just steal. That's the way it happened to me. Let's head over to Seagull Beach. See what's happening at this place that was once happening. Ah, but the sand deposited by the eager book dried up its future, so it was abandoned. People moved to Nuff Haven. Seagull Beach. This is where we first met, remember? Looks like the ship is still there. It is. And you know what I forgot to do, folks? I forgot to equip boat parts. I sure did. Ha 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 I believe he is up and sits the shop in the carpet mill. Oh well. Go back to the carpet mill. Get my boat body all set up. May have to trade off uh, my spiked ball arm or maybe my. Uh, actually, maybe my sword arm. I might have to trade an arm. Might have to give an arm to do this. That's all I'm trying to say. Alright, let's go ahead and uh, replace some frames here. Let's replace my body frame with a boat frame, mother. Yes. And, uh, my back frame, which will be lighter. The floaty. Now I'm back under the weight limit. Cool. Let's get out of here. Don't worry, my clock will be fine underwater. Hopefully. I can't quite jump on the carpet mill. No. Okay. All good information to know, right? Downstream, down here, I mean round here, I mean down round. I mean, let's just get moving. Hey, you finally managed to get where you were going, huh? I'll tell you what. At this point, why don't we save the data? And when we come back next time, folks, we can do the uh, aquatic adventure stuff. 
hanging out down by the old uh, hanging out by the old boat. I mean, yeah, by the old wreckage there. Actually, it might be worth it just to uh, go find a place to rest and um, do the boat searching in daytime. But uh, there's not a place really convenient to here. Yeah, well. Anyhow, folks, we'll puzzle that out next time. This is Bobo the Vulture, and this is Let's Play Steambot Chronicles, and I thank you very much for watching. Bye-bye now.